The name of the game in manufacturing is good parts out the door. To do that, you have to minimize downtime. To minimize downtime, you need properly trained technical people, technical support people. In the case of our training, we train people to troubleshoot and work with PLCs in automation. Starting with the instructor, the instructor needs to be someone that has thousands of hours, at least hundreds, on the shop floor doing what he's training the people to do. When I say thousands of hours, I really mean tens of thousands of hours. Beginning in the Marine Corps, uh, Vietnam, I was a ground pounder, but my secondary MOS was microwave radio technician. So I started out uh, ground pounding and repairing microwave radio equipment in the Marine Corps. I left the Marine Corps and started working, obviously, as an electronics technician. From there, I went to an electronics instructor and I taught a two-year program teaching electronics. Everything you can imagine involved with electronics. And from there, I went to a college to teach solar and wind energy and electronics. And from there, I went to Allen Bradley to teach CNC, computerized numerical control. When I left there, I went to working as a controls engineer full time. And eventually, after a number of years, went to work for one of Allen Bradley Rockwell Automation's best distributors as a course developer and trainer. And I did all the training for PLC, HMI, and Netlinks. So overall, I have more than 70,000 hours of experience combined in electronics as a technician, a controls engineer, and teaching. So that, that's pretty much a summary of my resume. This and is a typical class setup, and you can see each station has two manuals. Now, we normally do two per learning station. What we sell and deliver is two people per workstation. This was a class I did for some engineers in the Navy. You see these two manuals. This is for 500, I call it. Slick 500 Micrologics. These are the two manuals for our Logic Studio 5000. What is nice if, if the student gets a chance to take both of these classes, because in this class, they learn ladder logic and basic PLC stuff, IO scans and everything. In this one, if they've already learned ladder logic, 5000, ArsLogic Studio 5000, the tag structures, in other words, labeling of memory locations, pointers, registers, it's much more complex and more involved. If they've already learned ladder logic in the 500, when they take this class, they're looking at the exact same basic landscape, but they're in a different vehicle and they've got the experience of having been there before. We always recommend that you do the 500 first, then the 5000. I've actually done them in consecutive weeks had the students for two weeks in a row. This is the trainer for the 500, and you notice that, and also for the 5000, the 5000 that shows a Compact Logics L32E, but we also have some newer processors. Nonetheless, both of these learning stations allow the learners to do lab projects that 100% are portable to any version of ArsLogic Studio 5000. In addition to 500 and 5000, we also have con Connected Components Workbench with the Micro 800. These are the two manuals, hands-on lab project manuals that we use for our Micro 800 training with Connected Components Workbench. And actually, these two manuals combined have more lab projects than the other two. And this is the hardware trainer, one of the hardware trainers that we use. One thing I did fail to mention was that um, I actually did course development and training twice for Rockwell Automation. The first time it was actually Alan Bradley before they were purchased by Rockwell. That was the CNC. And then later on for Rockwell Automation and Mayfield Heights, I did course development and training for the hands-on technical training group. It was uh, PLCs, HMIs, and Netlinks. So twice I did course development and training for Alan Bradley Rockwell Automation. So that wraps up uh, my qualifications as a teacher, the qualifications of the learning materials, and the lab hardware. I believe I have, if not the best, some of the best training, hands-on, FaceTime instruction in the world for an English speaker. Thank you.